In this lecture, we will learn about long straddle strategy. Long straddle strategy can be executed by buying one call option and one put option at same strike price. The strategy should be employed in a volatile market environment when the price of underlying stock is either expected to fall or rise substantially in a short period of time. And the strategy should be adopted prior to an important announcement, quarterly result or a big political or economic news. The strategy is considered to be profitable when market moves in either direction. The maximum gain is unlimited as market moves in either direction and maximum loss is limited to net premium paid. Suppose stock A is trading at $47 in January 2018 and there will be a big news next day about the stock. So you enter a long straddle by buying a January 46 call for $2 and a January 46 put for $1.5. The net debit taken to enter the trade is $3.5. As the lot size is 100, the net premium paid is $350, which is your maximum possible loss. If on expiration date, the stock is trading at $57 by the impact of news, the 46 put will expire worthless, but the 46 call expire in the money having an intrinsic value of $11. Subtracting the initial debit of $3.5, your profit comes to $7.5 per share or a total sum of $750 for executing the long straddle strategy. In the same way, if stock is trading at $35, after the impact of news, the call expires worthless, but the 46 put expire in the money having an intrinsic value of $11. Subtracting the initial debit the profit comes to $750. On the other hand, if the stock is still trading at $46 on expiry, both the 46 put and 46 call expire worthless and you suffer a maximum loss of $350 that is your net premium paid to enter the trade. The best tip to make maximum profit from this strategy is to cut your both the positions whenever you get a near about 200% of your premium paid in profit. Because in most cases, the news impact is short-lived and if you don't cover your trade, you suffer loss most of the time. In this chart of Infosys, see the impact of news when Infosys indicated its 13,000 crore rupee share buyback offer to open on 30th November 2017. And after this news, the stock made a up move of 5.5% the next day and then it made a fall of 15% in next 3 days. In the second example, this is the early chart of Nifty. Before Gujarat polls result, the Nifty made a fall of 190 point in just half an hour and then recover from there to the same level in next hour by giving a up move of 348 points. In both the examples, the call and puts gave a return of 300% and it was only the impact of news. So, if someone entered the long straddle strategy, he could have made a profit of 300% here. And now, a much awaited union budget is here and it is likely to present on 1st February 2018. So, we can execute a long straddle strategy here. Currently, Nifty is trading at 10,700 level. So, we can buy a February 10,700 call and February 10,700 put simultaneously. Because we expect a pre-budget rally in Nifty before the event. The points to remember here are, if you are expecting a straddle in anticipation of a news event, you should exit quickly if there is no big move in the price. You can sell the profitable side after a price move and keep the unprofitable side in expectation of price retracement on other side. For example, if stock rises before or after a news announcement, you can book your profit by selling profitable calls. The puts at that point won't be worth much, but will increase again if price retraces downward. For this, you can draw a trend line for the up move of prices and exit from the calls option when trend line is broken downward. Thanks for watching the lecture. We'll see you in the next strategy.